guys, it's your boy Killikels here, and today in this video, I have a huge Supreme haul from week one. It just came in about three days ago. I've been holding off. I have every single package down here. I'm gonna show you all of the packages. I kind of changed my setup a little bit back here because it was getting old, so I just wanted to change it up for you guys, especially the three TV screens back there. They're not new. I just took down three different Supreme bags that I had put over them to just start using them a little bit more in my videos, but I don't want to hold you guys up in this video because I'm really excited to open up all of these boxes. I just want to talk about the last Supreme drop, which probably by now would be probably week three, I guess. Week two was pretty dope, and I like the sneakers that came out, but I just wanted to talk to you guys about week one. Week one was on a Monday, and I thought it was going to be on the Thursday before I came to realize that when I was looking at the drops, it actually was on Monday. So when I saw it was on Monday, I was thinking, well, they have a lot of cool stuff, so I'm just going to go for it. While I was in school copying the stuff, I noticed that a lot of the stuff actually wasn't selling out that quickly. Um, some of the stuff had sold out a little bit. A lot of the popular items that I thought was going to be popular did not sell out. I think one of the reasons for that was definitely because they had changed the date from Thursday to Monday. So I'm usually used to it being Thursday, 11 o'clock. Eastern Standard Time. It was actually on Monday, 11 o'clock Eastern Standard Time for me because I'm in North Carolina. So I'm guessing a lot of people did not actually know that they had changed the date back then. I'm gonna guess that a lot of people didn't know it was on Monday, so a lot of the stuff didn't sell out as quickly as it usually does. I'm gonna set you guys up here. I'm definitely gonna go ahead and get started into the video. All right, so I definitely wanna go ahead and get into all the packages and um, like I was saying, I'm gonna definitely go ahead and get into the first package. I'm opening by random, so for me, it's also a mystery unboxing. So the first package that I actually received was this. It's kind of a slim one. I'm not exactly sure what's in it. A lot of the packages came in different times especially the big packages that I have down there. As soon as I open it then, I'll show you as I pull out what's inside of it. I really do hope I get some stickers this time. The first thing I see inside of here is the classic Supreme bag with the white. So I've got so many of these now, it's time that I'm just storing them away. Let's go ahead and open it up. First thing I see is a pack of stickers. So and now on to what's actually inside the bag. I got a Supreme baseball jersey that has Supreme right down the buttons. I'm actually not going to un-DS this right now, but I'll break it out later on. But for now, I'm going to leave it in the bag so that way I can keep it dead stock. Oh, also, I think there's one more thing in the bag. It's a ball that actually has Supreme in the middle of it. Pretty sure if I bounce this off my wall, it's going to go flying. All right, so the next bag I'm going to open is this one. This is the second bag that actually came into the mail. I'm really excited to see what's in this one because I think I know what it is, but I'm not exactly sure. In the bag, we have a, a Supreme shoulder bag. This was definitely in week one. All right, this is unlike the other shoulder bag. The other shoulder bag was actually vertical like this, and it was like that, but this one's horizontal. And it fits really well with my outfit, so I'm definitely gonna have to take an Instagram photo with this. Make sure you guys go check out my Instagram at xkillakelsx. In the rest of the package is two Supreme box logos and another bouncy ball. I'm gonna have tons of these. On to the next package, we have, no idea what it is, obviously. Let's see, same thing as always. All right, inside we have a... Nani? I think this is a fanny pack, or waist bag, I should say. It is a black waist bag, yeah, pretty dope. It has a Supreme box logo on the front, also with the same X-Cross pattern. It has actually Supreme on the bottom. Let's see the space on it, because a lot of the bags don't have that much space. It does have that, it does have a, quite a bit of space, but I'm sure the last bag from the spring summer collection was definitely a lot bigger than this one. Two box logos and another bouncy ball. So like the emoji has up here, I'm gonna open an actual box this time. I'm pretty sure I know what this is. This is pretty dope. I want to open this like right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and like I said, open it right now. So speaking of boxes, before I open this one, I want to talk to you guys that are all new to this channel. I want to say that I always have my P.O. box down in the description. So if you guys want to write me something or send me a note, make sure to go check out the P.O. box address down below. So inside of this box, we have a crumpled up Supreme bag. It is the Supreme Thermos. This is for food, not for drinks. You can put soup in it. You can put hot or cold stuff in it. Okay, it does come with a spoon. It comes with a Supreme spoon right here. It almost looks like nail clippers. But folds out and turns into a spoon. 
this is what the inside looks like. It's very insulated and it lasts for 14 hours. And that is the Supreme Thermos. Two box logos. And we have another bouncy ball. So these are the last two packages for the rest of the video. This is a big box. Definitely gonna open this real quick. Probably not with the kunai, because I don't want to slice anything that's in here. So inside this huge bag, we have a another bag. Huge Supreme bag that holds one new supreme book bag this book bag is almost like the last one they've got supreme spelled down the spine of the book bag and then a box logo down here just like my other book bag so i'm probably gonna open this probably at the end of the video just to see how it looks like and see how it compares to my other bag two box logo one bouncy ball so on to the last package i have one big package this package I'm so excited to open. This is the last package I got. When I looked outside my door, I said, wow, that is one big pack. Ah! It weighs at a total of nine pounds and it did not sell out as fast as I thought it was on Supreme. It actually stayed there for a little bit, like I said, because it was probably on Monday, but this I'm definitely gonna have to use the old knife and this item I'm definitely gonna showcase up here. So let's go ahead and open it. All right, so I have the box open and it came with some styrofoam. I'm gonna go ahead and pull this off and we have one giant Supreme bag just like the one that was holding the book bag. I'm not exactly sure I'm gonna pull this out. I'm gonna pull it out kind of like this instead of by the handle. It is another box. <sighs> This is by far the largest Supreme bag I've ever had. Boom. Boom. There's a handle. And there's a metal box. This is the Supreme Diamond Plate Toolbox. This I've been waiting for a long time to get. Like I said, about three days ago is when I received it from the first week's drop. Not exactly sure what's in here. And inside, we have two box logos and one bouncy ball. This is perfect for any type of Supreme item that I put in here. I love the design they put on here, especially with the reverse embossed diamond plates here like a regular toolbox. That is pretty much the wrap up of this video. I'm gonna show you guys my book bag. That's the last thing I have to show you. Uh, the comparison of the two book bags, but this, this was pretty much the main attraction. I've been waiting for you guys. I didn't want to open it. I wanted it to be special. So like I promised, this is the other book bag that I had. It had Supreme around the actual handle and onto the other side of the book bag with the box logo down here. And I want to compare it by opening this other book bag that's down here. This thing. That one actually does not have that much space. I'm not even going to lie. I do have a little bit of accessories right here. I have the Supreme keychain, which is a nightlight. It's almost out of battery, so it barely works, but you should be able to see it on camera. I need to replace the batteries and then a little Air Mag keychain down there. So... This one, it definitely looks a lot bigger than the other one. Maybe that's just because that one's been compressed and used a little bit. This one, it might be the same size, hopefully not. Oh, I just want it to be bigger. It does not look to be that much bigger. It only expands to about right there. Although, this one only expands to about right there. I definitely like this one a little bit more because it has more noticeable features. I'm very, very happy about my new Supreme Toolbox that's down here. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm really enjoying my new Supreme Toolbox. I'll definitely show you guys in the upcoming videos. Make sure to go check out my Instagram. Check out the new photo for this video. Make sure to go show some love on that photo. And I will definitely see you guys in the next video. Also, school has just started, so I'm grinding these videos out as soon as possible. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.